Will Luffy save Sanji? The answer is no. I do not think Luffy is going to try to interfere in the wedding because Sanji left of his own free will. He also doesn't seem very concerned about Sanji. When, when Nami gave Luffy that letter and told him what happened, he literally looked at Nami and pretty much said, Why the hell were you crying? I can't say why the hell, but he was like, well, Nami, why were you crying? Who cares? Nami can handle himself. That was that he, he pretty much said, Nami, what the big deal? Like, Nami, even Zora was like, yeah, Nami got this. Like, and, you know, Nami and Chopper are like all upset, but Luffy and Zora are 100% confident in Sanji. Like, Luffy's not worried. Now, I don't want to make it out like Luffy says this, or Oda is, or anything. I don't want to bring a sentiment to this. But Luffy, the situation was very different with Robin. Robin was walking into death's door. Sanji getting married. Robin was going to die. There's a big difference between getting married and dying. There, there's a major difference there. Like, Sanji, like, Sanji isn't bound to this. Like, he doesn't care. I mean, what I personally believe is that Luffy may start, a, Luffy may end up saving Sanji indirectly. Because he'll probably, once he realizes that he'll be indirectly become a big mom's underling, I mean, that is the only thing I could think that would actually piss Luffy off and make him be like, well, I gotta get Big Mom's ass, like, right now. Like, the only thing that would, like, get him, like, into, like, a one that like, one track of mine of fighting Big Mom. The only thing would be the fact that that it would kind of, it would state in the chapter that it's Sanji marries this pudding girl. He will indirectly be turning the rest of the straw hat into the boredness of Big Mom. Which doesn't... I don't really understand how that works at all, but whatever. I mean, I, I really don't get that, but whatever. I still don't. I mentioned it in my review, but whatever. But the thing that I believe is really is that what may happen is that, as I mentioned earlier, Luffy will be going to attempt to save to a big, big mom, who will, like, crash the wedding and be like, you can, you two can get married for all I care. I need to kick big, Luffy will go, and he won't even, he probably won't even crash the wedding. He'll show up and be like, hey, big mom, I'm here to kick your ass. Because once I beat you, you'll, and then Sanji can marry the girl and do whatever he wants. Then, we, then Sanji can marry the girl, and you'll become my underling, get all kicked in your ass. Like, this is the way Luffy would think. He just, all Luffy, I see Luffy being concerned with is not being Big Mom's underling. Sanji said he'll be back. Luffy and Zoro trust Sanji. I'm emphasizing Zoro because it's Zoro. Because Zoro trusting you in terms of power says a lot. Also, but that it's Zoro and this is Sanji. I mean, you know. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please tell me your thoughts on whether or not Luffy will be interested in saving Sanji, or end up saving him indirectly, or whatever theories and predictions you have, or its overall thoughts in the comment section down below. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. This is One Piece Nation, signing out. Have a great day, guys.